The Rodriguez Show. And we are back on The Rodriguez, Rodriguez Show, Show, and we have our special guest for today. It's three of them. They're the homies, and we got a spe- another special guest hanging out in the back. First, I'm going to introduce Mello Thing. What's up, Mello Thing? Hey, what's up, everybody? Hey. What's going Mello. on? Hey. Also here, Lee MC Aude. What's up, man? Hey, everybody. What's up? Hey, Eddie Rotten, also here. What's Gucci? What's Gucci? Hey, nice. And a shout out to Eric Young hanging out in the back. Eric what's Young. up? Hey, yeah. Yep, yep. Hey, yeah. Yeah. Um, so, Soul out now. Go to listen to that shit. Yeah, yeah. Check out Soul. Um, <laughs> All right, and so you guys are here because all three of you guys worked on A Memory, uh, which is a collection of three songs, Memory, the single, as it's referred to. Uh, and yeah, man, how you guys been? Just chilling. Been, yeah, been probably good. making working. music, working. Been at our, probably like our our high, our high peak of productivity, I would say. We probably made the most music this year than we have before. Nice. Yes. Yeah. 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 I that, agree. Yeah. You've, you've been making a lot of music too? Yeah, we've been just like, one of the tracks actually... The hook of it says, like, working, yeah, but we've been working. So it's, like, it kind of resembles, like, everything we've really been, you know, doing. Like, it's crazy. Like, yeah. so I agree, yeah. yeah. Nice, nice. What about yeah. you, Melo? How's, how's beat making going? Have you it's made a quite, lot of beats this year? Yeah, I mean, it's, like, weird because I've, I've made less beats, but, like, my favorite beats this year. Nice. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was yeah, like, fuck. Like, the ones you don't want to let go, you're waiting for that special song, but yeah. these fools are special. I give them to them. Hey. <laughs> uh, so yeah so uh how did you guys come up with uh putting these three songs together it started with memory actually okay. uh, from what i remember um we were just in the studio i think i laid down or i don't know maybe eddie i don't remember but they all collectively came by just just connecting with one another in the studio and giving each other energy and and um feeding off each other and but uh I remember memory being one of the first songs we recorded, and and it led to us creating Sinsame mm-hmm. and yeah. Emma Roberts, and we just wanted to feed the same consistency of tracks, you know, that we yeah. that we released. So, 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 what? It wasn't like, oh, this is going to be just for you. It was like all you guys together were working on this. Yeah, um, I guess you could say that. Yeah, yeah. It was just like, because it's like it's credited under featuring Eddie Rotten. That's why I was wondering, like, what oh, the station. Oh, that that was mainly just because. It's because I don't want to pay like three hundred bucks. <laughs> Pretty much for this. <laughs> oh, okay. year to add another artist. <laughs> oh, I see. That's so that's yeah. being cheap, but yeah. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Or mainly me, yeah. but. Uh, so this is all three of you guys yeah. like working. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. It's a collaborative, yeah, yeah project. Yeah, like uh, a lot of the songs were made. Like I want to say, like the oldest like three years ago mm. and one like two years ago the other two two years ago and it was like a time when i was making beats on my iphone and i just found out like fuck the shit knocks you like yeah, yeah. <laughs> before i had yeah so so memory a memory and the song called emma roberts on there yeah. <laughs> those were made on my iphone damn oh, so, <laughs> yeah. so that's what i was like oh shit check it out they're like fuck it again it was like something fun just to do just because because of yeah. that reason too like fucking little like like quirky little thing you know yeah. So that's why, like, we didn't really take the songs like this is the one or like the serious like is that. Yeah. We're kind of just having fun. Nice. Yeah. Nice. But but so was there something just about a memory that was like the most special one? But you named the whole thing after it. I think for me it was like um, I do this thing when I get in the studio with Melo, where he kind of just lets me get like I just he lets me get thug thug with it, mm-hmm. and memory for me was that. Mm. And yeah. I think it just brought this crazy energy. <clears throat> That like, just let me be free, and um, and then let Eddie be free, and it just brought a great song that I feel hasn't been like around for a while. Like the sound, if you really pay attention to the track, it's like a really heavy energy. Yeah. So um, and then what I'm saying also, I talk about my mom and um how my dad laid down the foundation for me learning hard work and how he's in Beverly Hills, but. He's an immigrant mm-hmm. <clears throat> and how he's like, they came overseas to a better place and now they're seeing better things, you know? So um, yeah. the track means a lot to me, but it's because of the energy that I gave it. Yeah. And so, yeah. Well, for me, um, I really was just going off of like trying to stamp a moment. Like I'm a big believer in um, when we record a, tr- a song, mm-hmm. uh, we are leaving energy in there and we're able to capture an emotion that like long after whatever happens, we'll still be able to go back on that. Mm-hmm. And I I feel like the whole EP is just like a connotation to a memory just mm-hmm. for people to see, you know, like Melo said, we have the tracks on there that were three years old 
and for it to still hold this type of weight and for us to still look back at and want to broadcast you know it it means something because yeah. a, a lot of people don't know especially like on the type of artist you are we're we're putting in the effort and trying to make the tracks stacking them but probably not everybody's going to hear all the tracks we've produced you know what i mean yeah, made, yeah. so right it's a uh, it's just something it's a memory that we made together it's a couple of the brodies we come in do the track leave the energy and just look back on it nice that makes mm-hmm. sense, yeah. Uh, so, like you said, like the feelings are still there; they're powerful enough where you're like, even three years later, I want to release this still. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Melo, I wanted. To, can you talk a little bit about the production? Like, yeah, you made them on your iPhone, but like, yeah. how did the, especially like the video game noises and stuff? Like, oh yeah, oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, um, there. So yeah, like I said, I made them on my iPhone. So I was just messing around with that a lot, and um, yeah, a lot of the sounds are like weird ass sounds. Like, I have a, I have a Homer Simpson sample in there <laughs> on a memory. It's like a scream, but that's like. Homer screaming when he screams, you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know exactly what screaming is. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, so there's that. Like, so, yeah, like, so we're just trying to be more playful with it and experiment, like, just with the, the, the you know, the axis of the phone, just the idea comes to me, I could just do it right there and then, you know? Mm-hmm. Spot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, on the spot. Yeah, exactly. Like, just, like, capture that. So, <laughs> so that's even, like, well, cool, a memory. So the album's a memory. <laughs> you know nice, what I mean? It's like, nice. all, like, you know, it all relates later, you know, for yeah. me at least, you know? All connects in a weird way because like he said we made these songs years ago and and like at the time maybe we weren't like no nah, it's not we can make better or whatever we were thinking but it was at a period where we were producing a lot at the moment and then um to be able to, to go back to them and be like damn like this shit was low-key ahead of its time type thing you know what I mean? yeah. or, or it still holds like he said it still holds weight you know like mm-hmm. now so yeah a lot of production was just off my phone and whatever i could just import into there like before i ran out of gigs like nice. i've been using the same iphone since 2017 bro, so. oh, shit. <laughs> so i'm always deleting shit like you know yeah. like, so there's keep... beats in there i can't even get no more <laughs> That's funny. but yeah uh, nice nice yeah you can tell like there's like experts of here and there like stuff that you just found yeah exactly yeah, yeah. just like I, I try to just uh just keep it fun light nothing too serious because i feel like when i'm in the studio making beats it's like okay it's go time you're here you're paying to rent the space and your yeah. gear nah, nah. so it's you get in a different mood of different making beats you know because mm-hmm. even i've been making beats at home recently have like a little setup and um the beats i make there are like i feel more experimental more fun like you know what i mean it's like yeah. weird like how the environment affects you like that you know yeah because there's like less yeah. pressure you're just yeah or you, yeah or you're just like just soaking just reacting to your environment i guess sometimes yeah. you know on a show too yeah <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's crazy. I have a metal thing, like, you'll be like, oh, yeah, I'm just messing around. And then you'll, you'll, you'll be like an amazing beat. And like, oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, oh, yeah, here's something I was just playing shit, around right? with. There you go. <laughs> uh, so why did you, okay, so I understand. Why did you name the song Emma Roberts is what I want to know. <laughs> yeah, I think it was Eddie's idea. Yeah. 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 Bro, <laughs> the one thing you should know when you're with Eddie is his blunts on blunts and blunts. And sometimes you just come up with a random shit. At the moment, yeah. sounds right. But then you figure out, or you don't figure out why you named the track after a track. <laughs> so like, is that? But in the song, in the yeah. song, there's an ad lib that says Emma Roberts. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, so sick. yeah it's like an ad lib that it's a sound. It's throughout the song, but like you don't know what it's saying. So like you know, we just fade in. We're like, what is it saying? And yeah, it's yeah. like, it sounds like Emma Roberts. Yeah. I'm like, that's a cool name. Like, that's what you would call coke or something, you know? Yeah, it just sounded nice. It sounded exotic. <laughs> I was gonna be like, "What's your favorite Emma Roberts <laughs> movie? Like, what's going on?" <laughs> I think that's answer that question. <laughs> well, shout out Emma Roberts. Emma Roberts. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, she finds out and knows that there's like that's what they call coke. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. She's a white girl. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, that's hilarious. Um, so yeah, so I saw you guys have been outside this year for a while. Uh, how's the performing this year been? Uh, the perform- performance the uh, performances have been pretty chill. I think more than anything, it's just me honing down the right tracks that I do want to showcase. Mm-hmm. Uh, I am about to have a show on the first of June. Uh, I don't mean to plug right now, but uh, go, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, but uh, it's sort of like that where it's um it's planning out exactly, um, because I I do I. I I love the time and era that we're at right now as a musician because I could do whatever the fuck I want and nobody's going to like bat an eye mm-hmm. over like trying to like do this type of sound or do that type of sound. Mm-hmm. And I think more than anything, um, I think I just love being able to just make whatever the fuck I want without anybody really like, oh, you're not fucking this or that. Like, I mean, if Drake can do it, anybody can do it. You know what I mean? <laughs> that's true. So, if we've got an AI song out right now. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. 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 Rescue is a straight yeah. AI song. <laughs> like, he was like, fuck it. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Who made it? Fuck it. Credit on the snoop. Put it out. That's uh, funny. Because it does sound. It I is. Think that AI, AI Eddie Rodden song featuring 
<laughs> Eric Young and Liam Sellers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 you Produced by Melody. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Liam Sellers, how about you? you? You performed, right? You performed at Kid Vicious event? Yeah, it was um, for his album release show. Mm. Um, for Skyfall. Skyfall. Skyfall, nice. And um, we actually, he's, we were just exchanging conversation for a while. Um, that guy's just like a consistent artist, you know, um, and he just always, always reaching out, always reaching out. Hey, you want to make music? Hey, mm. and um, that's something I respect. Something I respect when it comes to music is like work ethic, you know. Yeah. And if 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 you're willing to work with me, then I'm I'm willing to work with you. So, mm. um, I responded the same way, and we just got to work. He started making some music. I did a couple tracks. He liked one of them, and and it ended up being ego for. Yeah, or um his album and yeah. you curated it actually yeah 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 and it was cool man um yeah shout out to him man he hey, shout out Ma- mikey's yes, gnarly that's one of my yeah. favorite yeah. 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 Miklo. Miklo now. Too. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's miklo now yeah, I think that, so. all right shout out miklo miklo <laughs> yeah so shout <laughs> out to both your your track your features on skyfall who and and igor are the yeah, best yeah. ones i put them yeah. in, a, in a place for a reason <laughs> right, yeah, <laughs> yeah yeah they're tight yeah, um man. so yeah so what are you guys working on right now yeah, who wants to go first? Let Melo, because Melo always has something. <laughs> with yeah, Melo, I forgot to ask. How, how's the the beat sets going? Like the live one, how was that? They've been fun, man. Like, uh, it, it's cool to like to just play shit that like no one would ever hear otherwise until mm. someone got on it or something. So it's yeah. cool, like you know. It's, I, sometimes I feel kind of funny. It's kind of like baiting rappers, like you want this beat. Yeah, but nah, but like you know, but yeah, it's been fun. Like, um, I have I have, I have a lot of fun with it because. Uh, I don't know how to DJ. I'm not like nowhere near what Mondo will be able to do, but it's fun to like be able to like mess with the sounds in that way. You know, like yeah. it's really it. something that uh, that I'm not I can't do unless I I'm the computer. It's you know it's mad tactile or yeah, it's harder. <laughs> it's like just it's on your hands right here. It's still <laughs> kind of like you build a groove to it, so you kind of like do kind of like build a type like a crowd control and shit. Yeah, you know exactly. What I'm yeah, yeah, like yeah. you're baiting rappers. Yeah, so it's like, like right like, there, it's like. Boom! I got your, I got your attention. Yeah, exactly, you know I mean? and, and that's your PG, bro. Yeah. I, I guess I, I like I, I can relate to that because like when I was did the beats at Skyfall, yeah. uh, there was this one dude just rocking with me the whole time, you know, <laughs> yeah. and like but he was not, he was like chilling hard, you know. And yeah. I was just like, all right, cool, that kept me going, you know. Yeah. Like, yeah. Didn't make me feel like I was like, ah, oh, damn, what's that, that wasn't hot or whatever. Yeah, 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 like, yeah that's right. Like, so nice. it's cool. It's cool to like be able to, to do that, you know. Cause that's I feel like I, I, I like a lot of producers. The best ones are like DJs, drummers. You know what I mean? Because they just be listening, you know? Like, yeah, you know? Showmanship, all that, you know? <laughs> so uh, so what are you working on this year, Melo, so far? Shit, um, right now, this is a lot of music. Um, I put out, that's why we put out a memory, because there's so much music we have, like, that we want to put out some way, shape, or form. But um, as far as, like, like continuously working on, like, right now I'm working on, like, a like a follow-up a follow to um, Rather Vex. Sorry. Mm. <laughs> yeah, like, something like that. Um. Sorry, bro. <laughs> no, that's okay. Only because <clears throat> it's dedicated to my mom, you know? Yeah. Rest in peace. Rest in, in peace, peace, but uh, yeah. Coming soon. <laughs> yeah. yeah, let's get it. My bad. No, it's no, okay. No, no, it's no, okay, no. man. Um, what about you guys? What are you guys working on? Oh, man, dude. As far as for me, is uh, I've been working on... I, I've been busy. I've been busy. Like, you know, Eddie Rotten just doesn't rap. You know, he also makes beats. I'm nowhere as good as a producer as Melo thing because he's a producer, he's a legend, he's a genius. Yes, I, yes. I keep telling people that I've heard Melo make like random sounds sound like nobody's business, mm-hmm. and I just make beats. <laughs> <laughs> like, he, he's good at it. Like he keeps me going because he does all the like Eddie does likes to do all the shit that I don't do. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. You got this loop off splice. Oh, yeah. shoot, it knocks. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you know, so. And I was like, uh, I appreciate it. Yeah. And uh, I, it's because I grew up more like like sampling, sampling. I, I grew up like admiring the MPC. I love ch- uh, just chopping, sampling, listening to songs. Melo's a producer. Like, if you wanted him to do, score a movie or to literally make an orchestra, he'd be like, You got two days, I got it. Like, me, <laughs> no, I'll try that. Yeah. I'm going to say, I got it, but I'm going to go to Melo and be like, Let's split the cash. But I've been doing that, but I've been doing a lot of uh, a lot of rapping, a lot of verses. Uh, I got a lot of stuff brewing within the community. I got, man, I probably got like a lot of shit with my boy Eric. You know, shout out to my oh, boy Eric. Sure. That's my best yeah, friend. Yeah, they've been working con- consistently every Bro, day, uh, man. Melo, Melo is my best friend. Eric is my best friend. 
and fuck it, it's just one of my best friends, and it's just like it's pretty sick that I still get to fuck around and just go to the studio, get to be with people, and we get to literally like time stamp what we're doing at that moment. Mm. And I don't know, I feel blessed to be an artist because like I could have. I probably could have been working at a fucking at City Hall, just being like, you have your papers for a tax, re-, you know, whatever. Yeah, and true. Boom. Uh, but I get to do this. I get to have fun. Uh, I get yeah, to really Ed, make it art first. Eddie's been a monster lately, man. He's been like bouncing between Eric's studio, my studio, and every whatever in between, like every day. Pretty yeah, much. Yeah, cool. like, yeah. Hey, this was Kobe in the fourth. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like he's the secret weapon, but, oh, yeah. you know. That's just, <laughs> that's true. That's true. And uh, I just also like being quiet. Like the one thing, like. Melo gets on my case a lot. Like he tells me, like I, I should show what I'm doing because I, because I'll be doing all this stuff. And he's actually the one that has made me like really refocus on trying to be as more more social on social media. Uh, but I do have a lot of stuff, and I just like being low pro because I like being the type of person that the proof is in the pudding. Yeah. I like when people hear me. I want them to say, "Damn, Eddie went that extra level," and mm-hmm. I didn't hear it because I just heard him from that last CP to this one, and it's like, what did he do before that? It can't possibly be. He just made another song that you know, yeah. and it's just like that. But that's enough about me. What about my Brody ish? Oh uh, shit! Um, uh, we just released a memory, so go, <laughs> go stream that. You know, first and streaming foremost, everywhere. yeah, streaming everywhere. And um, we're actually work. I'm actually working on um, a summer EP. Nice. I'm gonna drop. We're gonna drop singles. We're gonna drop a lot of stuff. Actually, we're we're working on also the second installment of Mass Rider. It's oh, okay. um yeah. it's a piece that we dropped a while back. It's on YouTube. It's like a short film we made. Super underrated. Uh if you guys want to check it out, go stream it. Nice. Um we're working on that. A lot of production, but it's a short film, so a lot of like um like, like uh, film like film production. Yeah. So I have to sit down with a lot of Yeah, that 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 project, the Master Radio, is fun to make actually because me and Ish made the or Liam Sore, uh we made the music like and everything like all the sound effects like everything you hear like like the audio drama before and then he took it to his homie lacobus rex he's like a like a, a videographer mm-hmm. and he brought it to life visually so it was a trip like oh nice you know what I mean? yeah. Yeah. yeah and so i'm sorry um so we're working on that and uh just like a lot of things actually i don't want to give too much away yeah, but a lot you're a very stuff. creative person, man. I'm like, all excited to hear to check out what you got going on. Thank you, all yeah. you guys. But yeah, dude. thank you, yeah, thank you, bro. Yeah. I appreciate it. You too. You guys are doing. It. I told you last time, man. You guys are doing it out here. Like, yeah, thanks. you're strong, you man. Great, thank, great, you. Great, great thank you for the cake too. Yeah. 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 Happy, yeah. happy yeah. birthday again. Happy yeah. birthday, dude! Yeah. Like, yeah. the tent's coming up, bro. Yeah. So that's gonna be. It's gonna be a big one too. The Rodriguez, Rodriguez show spectacular. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If your show was a kid, it'd be in uh, third grade. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So we're gonna get to performing a couple tracks before we do that. Though we have a segment called Dope or Nope. I'm gonna give you three topics. You're gonna tell me if you think they're dope or nope. Uh, just explain why. Are you guys ready for it? Yes. Sure. All right, let's go. Dragons, dope or nope? Dope. Nope. You don't like, why don't you like dragons? I don't like fantasy. I like sci fi. Oh, I see. <laughs> yeah. I think they're dope. I'm, I'm, right I'm here with the dragon and all that. So, <laughs> uh, cruises, dope or nope? Dope. Nope. No? You, why? I can't smoke weed at a cruise. Oh, uh, hey. Yeah. That, I, I, I did. I was on a, on a stizzy high the whole time. <laughs> hey, but my, <laughs> my stizzy rusted because all the sea, That's you know? What I'm really? Yeah. yeah I was actually on the balcony hitting it, and one day I just all rusted, bro. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> you <hate> rust. <laughs> <laughs> you see what it, would you go on a cru- cruise? Oh, uh, I have never actually been on it, um, but I would. You would? Yeah, yeah. I would. Uh, and then uh, the third one here, pineapple on pizza, dope or nope? Dope. 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 Yeah, I can take it or leave it. Yeah. <laughs> I like it, I like yeah. it. Uh, all right, you guys ready to do a couple tracks? Yeah. Yes, yeah. sir. All right, this is Mellow Thing, Liam Ciore, and Eddie Rotten on The Rodriguez Show. The Rodriguez Show. <laughs> See the slow time flame escape For some counted days could smoke All around my face can For at least today change See the slow time flame escape For some counted days could smoke all around my face, counting for release today. Do you feel better when you ignore these realities? 
Do you pray for all your life? Cause you gotta a pray in these times Got my mom and my pops living this rough fucking life I got so much to supply So I gotta work hard on my own time I wanna show love cause I've been hurt I seen the devil the tricks on me On me and my family This ain't the first time I had to die or by the council This ain't the first time I had to die by the council By me and my downfalls This ain't the first time I had to die By me and my council or me and my downfalls Since to me, me. mind playing tricks on me I think I'm just losing my senses Nothing been making no sense And I can see under those eyes Possession the way that described I don't pray for you, you're one I can see something's got a hold of them Devil's in the details, son Fuck it, I'm doing the most with just what I got Jesus, I'm praying to him a lot I'm worried these demons, they have me caught Trying to shake them, I want them gone Holy Spirit, need the Holy Ghost Lay these evils down, keep them down for show Trying to guide my family through this bumpy road Will you lay your life for the love you know? Change. see the slow time from escape For some counted days could smoke all around my face, Captain, for at least today, change. See the slow time frame escape. For some counted things, Kushmoor. All around my face, Captain, for at least today. Eddie Rotten, Lee M. Ciori, and Melo Thing on The Rodriguez Gracias. Show. Hell yeah. That was so good. Cool. That, that was dope, guys. <laughs> Thank you for doing that live in the studio. We got um, a release party coming soon, so come on out. Hey, it announces pretty soon. Hey, release party happening hey, soon. Man. Follow them on Instagram. Uh, you can follow Lee M. Ciori. You can see them all on the screen, but see M. Ciori underscore, Eddie underscore Rotten, and Melo uh, Thing underscore as well. Uh, and that's it for this week, guys. Thank you for tuning in. Keep it funky. Thank keep it guys. fresh. Keep, keep it, it sexy. sexy. Yeah, eight years. Hey, thanks. <laughs>